Everybody, run! The PC police are coming to get you. If political correctness is running rampant and making people shut up, why is a homophobic, anti-woman, anti-Muslim lunatic like Ben Carson still talking on national television? And this is one of the myths that the left perpetrate. And this is how they frighten people and get people to shut up. You know, that's what the PC culture is all about and it's destroying this nation. Wow. Isn't it refreshing when the very people who should be the most correct politically, that is to say politicians, have such a disdain for political correctness? Oh, he's not, he's not a politician. He's just trying to sell books. Okay, got it. Political correctness doesn't shut people up. That's a myth. It informs us. That's like saying global warming is forcing you to stop driving a Hummer. You can do whatever you want, but the world would be a better place if you weren't such an entitled f***ing asshole. What kind of psychotic supervillain gets so exasperated over the concept of being a slightly better person? Oh, that's right. It's not easy to grasp the plight of the marginalized when you're already on top of the world. Saying Perfect that the idea that Islam. someone should be killed if they leave the Islamic religion is just a few bad apples? So I get it. But what horrible punishment have the PC police inflicted on these people? Did Santa cancel Christmas because your barista said happy holidays instead of Merry Christmas? Is your child confused about their sexuality because Target doesn't have gender toy sections? Does saying trans instead of tranny affect your day-to-day -day life? Before you answer, consider the 41% of trans Americans attempt suicide. So just maybe that kind of inclusive language has real meaning. Political correctness isn't a movement. It's not a group of people. There are no real PC police. It's just a simple request to be a good person, to understand that there are other people who can feel oppressed or hurt by your words. You don't want to do that? You want to go out on Halloween in blackface? Are you allergic to being a good person? Fine, be a piece of shit. But don't get pissed when someone calls you out for it. We all have freedom of speech, but that doesn't mean we should ignore the consequences of the mean things we say. Like the old saying goes, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't be a dick. Dick. That's like saying global warming is forcing you to stop driving a Hummer. You can do whatever you want, but the world would be a better place if you weren't such an entitled asshole.